Excuse me if it looks like I've been sweating. I have. You see, I woke up, went downstairs to find a lizard on my steps, not even downstairs in the living room, trying to come up to my bedroom, okay? Now I'm all for divinely guided signs from the universe. However, Stu was not here to chase the lizard out of the house. Your girl has been panicking for the last 10 minutes straight. I'm moist in places that I do not want to be moist. However, <laughs> today is another roomy in me. I even did my makeup for this. Like, that was the thing. I did my makeup. I immediately got to the stairs to come downstairs and record. I saw the lizard. I took off my wig, okay? I brushed my wig today. Stuart would be proud, okay? Because I usually don't brush my wigs. However, like I said, another roomy in me. Last week, we made the mistake but honestly, nothing's ever really a real mistake, but we made, we made the, you know, the accidental repeat of a storyline, okay? And so that's why I got this marvelous idea to dot the page as I go. So we're going back in here for another one. Boom. Oh, and it's back on the I don't need. I guess that's a message for somebody to hear, okay? But not me. I need another one. come and see me. So the question is, how do you see yourself? Let me know down below. But after this intro, we're going to go ahead and get into it. Oh, but before we go, I want to give a quick shout out to Araceli Espinoza and Cool Breeze for being members of the channel. You too can become a member of the channel. It's 99 cents to be a part of the phalanges. Then we got the brains, we got the hearts, and we got the soul, okay? Um, so if you're interested, press the join button so you can look at what comes with it. But if we're going to be real, you're really just donating to the cause at this point because your girl is never recording and doing stuff like she should, okay? I'm getting back on it, okay? I I don't know what stopped me, but sometimes you always have like a little area of pause. However, come and see me. I'll see you after the intro. It was at this moment that he knew. He fucked up. Come and see me. And again, the question is, how do you see yourself? Okay, so now I have to read the poem. Come and see me. Today I am away, out of this world, hidden away from me and I. I grabbed a dagger, made slices of me from myself, since I belong not to me, not to anyone. I am so sorry for not having done this cutting away before. It was my soul's mind and not mine. I have no idea how my inner fire is burning today. My tongue is on a different flame. I see myself with a hundred faces and to each one I swear it is me. Surely I must have a hundred faces. I confess none is mine. I have no face. Again, the question is, how do you see yourself? And here is my answer, at least from August um, 26, 2021, I do believe. I see myself as a soul living in a human experience. There are many facets when you look at yourself in that way. It validates my existence when I speak about how my soul is me without being me. I see myself as a fighter, but sometimes I am weak. I see myself as bossy and stubborn and kind. I recognize the purity of my soul, but also recognize the human emotions that taint said purity. I see myself as lonely and happy. Mostly, I see myself at peace nowadays. Um, I like the idea of when I wrote this, I was feeling more at peace. And definitely, definitely, I'm going to go off on a tangent of uh, what older Aaliyah really wrote. Um, or am I older Aaliyah because I've lived more lives? But it was in the past, so that's old. It's interesting. But um, I wrote that, I think, with this idea that the peace that I feel now is my own and I don't have to work that hard for it. Now, keeping that in mind, I haven't had to work too hard for my piece. I've just kind of existed and it's been a beautiful existence if I will. 
um, I still feel like I'm at peace. Even though I had to chase a lizard out of the house and I was panicking and now I'm all sweaty, I still feel like I'm at peace. However, I think that nowadays my peace is more so like a a medium point. I feel like everyone should enjoy at least this level of peace. Um, and I'm going on a tangent. I really am going on a tangent. And I don't really know where to go from that. I still do believe that we are souls living the human existence. And also to a certain extent, I believe that we signed up for the lives that we are living. We might not have known all the details, but you know, that's what's fun about life. There's, you know, there's fate. And then there's like also prescribed um, or things that we're, we must do um, in order to live our lives and things like that. So I don't think that everything is by chance. I think that you can like unlock multiple, you know, the multiverse, right? I think that you can unlock um, multiple different realities depending on the things you do. But also on another note, I also believe that um, there is a, a reality in which maybe I never uh, experienced trauma. There is a reality in which I've experienced something else. I don't know too much about that person. I don't even know if me and that person ever met each other, would we even like each other? But I think that there exists in this world an infinite number of possibilities. And if an infinite number of possibilities exist, why not? Um, very open-minded with this whole idea of um, my place in this world. And I'm looking forward to see if the world will show me where I need to be. But right now, I am just another big titty woman on the internet um, asking for your attention. So thank you for giving it to me. <laughs> Much love and positive vibes. Leave your answers to the questions down below. And if there's anything you would like to see on my channel, let me know. I might not do it, but I do read these comments, okay? I get around to it. Like someday, like it'll take me a while. Sometimes I just read them once a month um, because I don't get messages too fast. But then other times, I'm all on it like a bag of nacho cheese Doritos. Bye. <laughs> oh, much love and positive vibes. Hope to see you next time for another Rumi and I. See, and also I wanted to go off on a tangent right there because y'all, I know it's Rumi and I now. You know, usually I ask, is it Rumi and me or Rumi and I? But I know it's Rumi and I, okay? So bye.